death news. Now, I don't want to scare you, but we're all going to die. I probably did want to scare you. There's no other reason to shout that out in a room of people. We're all going to die, and it's not looking good according to some of the newspapers. Here's some headlines. Flesh eats spiders coming to house near you. (gasps) Oh, my God. I hate flesh eat spiders. <laughs> Me, big hate, bad grammar. <laughs> yeah, these flesh eating spiders coming to a house near you, which is not all bad because I don't actually like my neighbours. So. <laughs> wake me up by mowing your lawn I'm going to hope spiders eat you that's how it works so these flesh eating spiders that are going to kill us all there we are it's the false widow spider you may have heard of uh, you're recognisable by its large body its cream markings and its insistence that its husband went out to sea in a canoe so he was keeping it topical is that four years ago <laughs> one person clapping is my favourite response to a joke so these scary little monsters, uh, well, what have they been doing to us? There's another headline. Killer spider made my leg explode. They're working with Al-Qaeda. <laughs> this is a worrying thing. Uh, they're called, yeah, the false widow spiders. Do you know how many thousands of people are killed each year by these monsters? Zero. Um, zero people have ever been killed by the false widow spider. Uh, but that's not the point. According to experts, just one bite from these could kill a full-grown man if he is extremely allergic to the bite. Um, so in a, in a way, it's like anything. That if you are extremely allergic to it, it could kill you. So if you're not one of the lucky few that belongs to that 99.9% of the population that's not allergic to them, you're safe, right? Wrong. Invasion of the mutant killer rats. <laughs> now, I'm less worried about these, more worried about the ninja turtles they've been training. That's, that's... <laughs> They've got it. Show my age. There it is. Uh, yes, these, uh, it's a genetic mutation, which means that these rats aren't going to be killed by the poison that we put down for them. This always happens. This is just a, like a law of nature, that if you put some poison down, you kill most of them, apart from the ones that are resistant to the poison. They're the ones left to repopulate, and soon enough, all the rats can't be killed by poison. It's the same thing that's happened with MRSA. Thanks to mankind's pointless meddling in nature, we're now left with poison-resistant rats... Uh, antibiotic resistant bacteria and if we're not careful about that cull bulletproof badgers <laughs> just saying you've been warned uh, so what have they been up to these killer rats mutant killer rats target RMPs they're trying to bring down the government they're working with Al-Qaeda <laughs> this is terrifying so if you're not an MP and you're not allergic to spiders you'll be safe yeah nope look at this forget, forget the storm Test Daly's boobs explode. <laughs> They're working with Al Qaeda. 